name's Alex from LearnCube, and today I want to show you the pointer tool. This helps you get to the right part of the right page with your student. How do we use this? So the idea is that if we're remote, then sometimes we want to be able to really show a particular part of a page and make sure the student is seeing the same thing. But for example, the student might have a different size device. They might be looking on their mobile phone. They might be looking on a very large screen. So the size of the screen or the size of the display might be different. So scrolling in sync isn't really uh, as easy. But what we can do is use our pointer tool. And I want to show you that right now. So our pointer tool, for example, is shown right here. And you can see that there's a nice little orange glow when I hold down the mouse. Now, how this is shown as a, on a student side is as follows. If I am, let's change to this particular um, screen. If I use the pointer tool here, I can highlight the car. I can highlight the, the, the trolley. And again, highlight the, the part of the page that I want the student to look at. So now if I'm the teacher and I want to show a part of the page, so here I've put a little cross um, or I could put a little tick box um, right here. Now, if I'm at the teacher, of course, I can see that because that's the part of the page I'm looking at. But you can see here that the student wouldn't see that. It's below the fold. So what I can do here, now you can see I'm at the top of the page. If I use the pointer tool right here, hover over the particular part of the page, looking at the student view, you can see that I've already locked in to the part of the page that is uh, right, or the, the, the part of the page that the teacher wants to see. So I hope you've found this useful and you can use this pointer tool to be able to get to the right part of the right page.